guys, today I'm going to be teaching you the hammer song. So repeat after me. If I had a hammer, I'd hammer in the morning. I'd hammer in the evening. All over this land. I'd hammer out danger, danger. I'd hammer out a warning, warning. I'd hammer out love between my brothers and my sisters. Let's dance. So during this next part, you can dance however you want to. Use your favorite moves. So repeat after me. La 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 So that's the whole melody. There are a few other verses. So the second verse is if I had a bell, had a bell, I'd ring it in the morning. Uh, the third verse is if I had a song, I'd sing it in the morning. Then the fourth verse, we do hammer, bell, and song. And then uh, the words are a little bit different. On that last part, it's the hammer of justice, justice. It's the bell of freedom, freedom. It's the song about love between my brothers and my sisters. And then the last verse, we say this song is over, over, but we're still singing, singing a song about love between my brothers and my sisters. Let's stop. And that's it. That's the whole song. Once you're ready to sing it all together, go find the other video that has the whole song. Yo, so I'm going to teach you a song called Jesus Loves Me. So most of you probably are saying, oh, Sam, I already know how to sing Jesus Loves Me. I sang it all the time as a baby. Well, you're wrong. I'm going to teach you how to play Jesus Loves Me rock and roll style. So if you got long hair like me, let that thing fly. Let's see it. Let's, get, let's see these rock and roll. Get your rocking hands out. Um, do everything you can because this is a really cool style. So the majority of the song is all repeat after me, um, but there are some motions. All right, so... Um, repeat after me. G Jesus loves me. This I know. For the Bible tells me so. Ouch! Little wants to. Him be long. They are weak, but he is strong. And then I'm going to say, spell it out now. So, spell it out now. J. Make a J. B. S. U. S. So you're gonna spell your you're gonna spell Jesus out with your body, and then you'll repeat the song. So cool. Pretty easy song, really fun song. Just get into it. The more rock and roll the better. Let's get to rocking. The next song we'll be doing is King of the Jungle. So repeat after me. Who's the king of the jungle? <laughs> Who's the king of the sea? Bubble bubble bubble. Who's the king of the universe? And who's the king of me? His name is J-E-S-U-S, -S, yes! 
He's the king of me. He's the king of the universe. The jungle and the sea. Bubble, 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 pop, whoop, whoop. Hey, everyone. So this song is called We Lift Up. It's a way to sing the prayers of the people that's usually done in a traditional worship service. It was written by my friend, uh, Nick Earhart. He worked at Rainbow Trail Lutheran Camp uh, the same summer I did, and he wrote the song in 2012, and it's really cool, really powerful. I'm a big fan of his work and his music, and I just want to say thank you for letting, um, thank you to him for letting me play the song and to uh, maybe sing it wrong. But, so, it's two parts. So, there is a part that will be sang throughout the piece, and that's your part. And I'm going to teach that part to you right now. So um, you'll sing that throughout on repeat while I sing over on top of you. So your part goes like this, all right? So repeat after me. Easy enough. So when I play those chords, you'll sing that part, and then I'll sing on top of you. So I'm going to go ahead and start by singing your part, then you'll keep it going, and I'll go into singing the verses, all right? And every verse I sing is like a different prayer for different parts of the world. Um, and as I sing it, we're praying for um, those things. Um, another thing to notice, uh, there's two things to notice. So I'll say, for the chance for a prayer for everyone. And when you hear me say, for a chance, for a prayer for everyone, I'll stop singing and I'll leave it just to your part to keep going and I'll be playing the chords. And that's when I invite you to speak prayers. So you'll say, a prayer for John, a prayer for Avery, a prayer for those impacted by COVID-19, which is everyone. Um, and then I'll play that a couple times just so you could say your prayers out loud. And then I'll say the words, for our words and for our silence, and then we'll pause and stop. And then we'll all close with the ooh, ooh, amen. I know that was a lot, but it'll make sense. <laughs> 